Do you think I can beat the chess computer 2000 rated in Chesscom blindfolded? Let's see together. Chapter number five of the chess super challenge event blindfold. <laughs> Hello everyone and welcome back. My name is Nitzan Steinberg. I'm chess grandmaster in this YouTube channel. And today, my viewers, this is the time, the final part of the chess super challenge event. After winning against the 400, 800, 1200 and 1600 rated computers all while playing blindfolded, it's time for the ultimate test today. I'm taking on a chess com computer rated 2 thousand and as always i will not be able to see the pieces but you can watch the game unfold in the top right corner as i face my toughest challenge yet will i complete the series with a perfect record or will the 2000 rated computer finally break it break me break it i don't know let's find out so i will click on settings I will put the blindfold save and now all the pieces disappeared for for the last time here oh coach David from Poland I'm afraid but let's do it play e4 knight f3 bishop b5 we are playing the Spanish a6 bishop a4 knight f6 castle b5 bishop b3 a4 let's play until now the Rui Lopez the Spanish ma one rook b8 uh, you know he's playing until now the best castle this I'm not sure because I think this is this is the move but now d4 bishop e7 wow bishop e7 okay let's take a b5 Now let's take here, knight xc4, now maybe bishop e3, also bishop d5 immediately looks interesting for me, um, you know what, let's play bishop d5, knight c5 probably, knight g5, wow, this is interesting solution by my opponent, um, wow, okay, I, I didn't think about knight to g5. Let's think. I thought bishop c6, but d takes c6, queen d8, there is knight takes a3 check, and after it rook takes d8. This is my problem. Um, so I think knight g5, probably, but also bishop takes g5 with, I don't know, knight bd2, looks fine. Um, I don't know which piece I want to to play with the knight on f3 or the bishop here yeah this position I need to think Not sure. I'm not sure. Let's play knight g5. F4. Bishop e3. B4. I didn't think. I thought bishop b7 he will play. B4. I think c4. C4 looks great. Bishop b7. Now he won't play some ah if you want to play d6 so queen f3 should be the move here king h8 he wants now f6 yeah he's a strong player knight d2 let's play f5 wow f5 i thought maybe i have also e6 but let's develop a piece let's play knight b3 right now rook a8 yeah nice move by my opponent um no, 
also rook a d1, but I'm not sure I really want to bring him the option to. You know what? Let's play rook a d1. I, I don't know. I'm not afraid from rook a2. Queen e8 was played. Okay, 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 okay. Knight c5 looks interesting for me. Let's play knight c5. Rook b8. Wow, I think it should be losing for him. Um, but let's think how. Maybe I will take it. And e6. E6. Rook, oh, this one I missed. I missed this one. Rook f6. Rook f6, I missed. Um, yeah, I missed this one. Let's play rook f e one. Yeah, I thought about yeah he's sacrificing his um, exchange d takes and now bishop f two I thought to play. Now I I attacking this pawn on e six bishop f six. Yeah, he's playing strong. He's playing strong. Queen d five. I have a move. Interesting move. No, I think queen d five. Interesting solution. E five. Wow e5 i'm not sure about this one i can take it i can take bishop e7 yeah this position should be losing for him e6 king g8 okay now it's i can take the pawn on f5 right i can take it i think i will take it queen f8 okay now queen e4 let's play no maybe queen d5 why not do d5 Queen e8, now queen d7. Rook b8, yeah, nice move by my opponent. Um, the computer, of course. Queen c7. Now coming back to d7. Queen f8 he played, okay. Let's play rook f1 also, interesting, right? Rook f1. Knight e5, yeah, this one I missed. Um, Queen d5 probably. Knight takes c4, yeah. Looks promising for him, but bishop h4 I have. Queen e8, I will take this one. Now rook f7 looks very bad for my opponent, the computer. Queen e8, now e7. e7 looks, oh no, 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 e7. Queen takes here, also winning. Also winning, um, you know what? But I'm not sure. He played h6 or not? I don't think he played h6. And if he didn't play h6, it's really strong. Wow! 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 E7. I will play it. Let's play. Queen d8. Now take this one. Ta rook d8 check. Promoting a queen. Yeah, this one queen c7. Take on c4. Wow, it's not so easy here. Take this pawn, right? I have also pawn on b2. I think I have. Yeah, now it's just winning. Queen c3 b4 b5 oh b6 b7 b8 queen uh, queen e5 queen c7 queen e8 checkmate on the board i beat coach david from poland 2000 rated computer it's unbelievable 56 moves in my mind thank you very much wow it was really tough but let's see the game so i will put classic here and let's analyze this one wow 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 i don't have words to explain to you what i feel right now
e4, e5, knight d3, knight c6, bishop b5. So the Spanish here, the Rui Lopez, and now b5, bishop b3, bishop c5, and now a4. I'm attacking this pawn on b5. Rook b8, it's one of the moves here. Also, bishop b7, he can play. But he played the move rook b8. c3, castle, and now d4. The move here is d6. After d4, bishop b6, and now a5, bishop a7. Uh, the point here after a5 that if bishop takes, of course, d5, I think is winning absolutely. And if he's playing knight takes a5, I have like rook takes a5, bishop takes, and d takes e5. And this is attack, right? Because d takes e5, just queen takes d8, king takes knight e5 with double threat here. Uh, yeah, this is problematic so much problems for black to handle uh, so c3 castled was not a good move here d4 bishop e7 now a takes b5 strong move yeah great a takes now d takes e5 this was not accurate oh d5 <gasps> i missed this one the knight the knight on c6 just blunder the knight knight a7 knight a5 he can play and knight b4 yeah that's it i just grab a full knight wow Unbelievable that I missed this one, but d takes e5 has played knight e4, bishop d5, knight g5. Now I thought for a long time I took with the knight and f4 with bishop e3. I like it. b4 was a mistake in my opinion because now c4 and this bishop will be better, right? Because this pawn is grabbing it, right? Uh, so bishop b7. Now I thought maybe he wants to play d6. And I will play the move queen f3, uh, just not to allow d6 because this knight on c6 will be weak. So king h8, knight d2, f5, just knight b3, rook a8, rook a d1, yeah, great. Queen e8, now knight c5. I thought that if we will take with the bishop, just bishop takes and attacking the rook. Oh, sorry, the rook on f8 and, you know, th there is nothing to do with it, right? Rook f7, rook g8, just I have a bishop. So, yeah. He played the move rook b8 now, just take, take, and e6. Rook f6 I missed, but now rook f1, and I'm waiting. Yeah, rook takes, bishop takes, d takes, bishop f2, slowly move, attacking this pawn on e6, bishop f6, uh, and now queen d5, strong move, I think, you know. In my mind, it's not so easy to see this, because I'm attacking this pawn and also this pawn on uh, f5, and of course, I have this pin, so after e takes d5, just rook takes e8, we checkmate on the board. So we played the move e5, just took it. Bishop e7, e6, take this pawn, uh, and taking some pawns here, take one, another one, and some grabbing pawn, rook f1, uh, to play in this file, it was important for me, knight e5, queen d5, now bishop h4, and I think, you know, the most beautiful tactic I played here is e7, the best here was queen g5, yeah, I forgot about this, yeah, I forgot about this one, but e7, I'm just sacrificing full rook, but hey, rook d8, queen d8 check, after rook takes just queen uh, I don't know I just can take that like this but also yeah I can do like this no queen a takes takes rook b8 yeah this position lost uh, for him of course but he played the move queen a8 now take this one another sacrifice of queen but I'm bringing the rook and yeah this position just game over take the pawn and promoting another one and putting checkmate on the board wow Wow, for me, it's like a dream came true. I won five computers blindfolded. And, you know, today it gets 2000 rating. If you like this video and this series, press the like button. Subscribe my channel for more chess content. See you soon in the next challenge. Who knows what, we, what it will be. Bye-bye.